Like so many other events, the Akron Marathon will happen virtually this year. They're encouraging runners to map out their own 26.2 mile course and run any time within this month. For one participant, the event means so much more than just a race. One local dad is running a full marathon around the hospital where his son is staying for cancer treatment. Lindsay Buckingham has this amazing story. I don't think there's any way to, to, to convey how proud of, of Andrew we are. He just takes everything so positively. He's got this amazing outlook on things. As a parent, you'll move any mountain, fight any battle, run any distance to help your child. For Colt Codner and his wife Tristan, truer words never spoken. Kind of right around the, the beginning of quarantine. We started noticing some like swelling around his eyes. I thought, okay, you know, it's probably, you know, allergies, something like that. It wasn't allergies. At just four years old, Andrew Codner diagnosed with leukemia. That day was the worst day of uh, my life in terms of just kind of that emotional roller coaster. The next few hours, gut wrenching, a complete blur. But even in his parents' darkest hours, Andrew's light came beaming through. And so it's the first time he's ever been in a hospital overnight and we get to up to his room and, you know, Tristan and I are sitting there very, you know, just concerned and dejected and you know, all of those emotions you would expect. And he looks up at us and he goes, all right, so what are we gonna do now, guys? Andrew has a long road ahead, made easier by medical caretakers at Akron Children's Hospital and his favorite nurse, Josh. It's been this amazing thing to see these folks uh, during this really difficult time connecting with him, not only as a caregiver, but also as a, you know, just a warm person who cares for, for him. It's been you know, impossible to convey how much we appreciate what those folks have, have meant to, to him and to us. Heroes all around, but none more than Andrew, inspiring his own dad to tackle a valiant mission himself, running a full marathon around the hospital where his son will be inside. So I'll be running around his room. He's all excited about making uh, signs and he's gonna bring the medal. And then whenever I get done, you know, I'm gonna come up to the room and he wants to give me the medal up there. You know, those, those inpatient days tend to be pretty long days in the hospital where you're just kind of hanging out. Um, so hopefully that'll, that'll break up, uh, you know, four or five hours of his day and, and keep him entertained. Going the distance for Andrew and all the other kids courageously battling pediatric cancer. I mean, all of these kids are phenomenal. Um, the stuff that they're asked to endure and the, and the way that they do it, um, you know, it's nothing less than just incredible. I would just tell Andrew how proud of him we are and, and what an inspiration he is. Um, and that, you know, I hope, you know, he's as proud of, uh, uh, of us as, as we are of him. Lindsay Buckingham, 3 News. Yeah, I'm sure he is, Dad. Just an incredible act of love and service. And we have some good news to share. Andrew's prognosis is excellent. Doctors say his cancer has a 95% cure rate, and we are thrilled to hear that. Also, we wouldn't miss Colt's amazing run. So we're going to be there with our cameras live tomorrow morning to see him take off. You can join him by watching our Go Team starting at 5 a.m.